Hey circus freaks! Welcome to another edition of Cruddy's Clown School. I am Cruddy Pants, world famous clown and entertainer. I'm also available for bronco busting, shoe and leather repair, and unproven laboratory experiments. Today, I'm going to show you how to be a mime. Now, there's a lot of classes you can take, and as research, I took one yesterday. Oh really? Did you pass? I have no idea. I couldn't get a word out of the guy. Anyway, I figured that my advice would be a lot better than a bunch of out-of-work Frenchmen. Am I right? Uh, hey, sis, can you help me out here? Ah. Oh. Ah. Thanks, sis. Hey, where's my beer? Oh, um, I hit it. I didn't want to contribute to the delinquency of mimers. That doesn't even make sense. Anyway, to be a great mime, you have to wear white gloves. I have no idea why, but just do it. You'll be halfway there. Alright, you ready to try one? Okay, let's go. Okay. What am I doing, sis? <gasps> You're climbing a rope. No, for crying out loud, I'm milking a giant cow. <sighs> Alright, let's try another one. You are doing something that you've probably never done in your entire life. You are so correct. But, as soon as I can afford two clown horns, I plan on honking them simultaneously. I could have been anywhere. Could have done anything. Instead I came here. Why did I come here? Because you obviously wanted to be a mime. Just like trillions of others out there. And now you're learning. Okay, let's try one more. Ready? Okay. All right. Are you fishing? No, you imbecile. I'm cranking up my penile device. I'm sorry, you can never be a mime. Uh, did... Did you just call me an imbecile? Uh... No. Okay, well, must be hearing things. Let me try one out. You know, let's see how I'm doing. Lame. In fact, lamer than lame. But it does remind me of a joke. If you shoot a mime, do you have to use a silencer? Mm. My answer would probably be no. 